this is Chris, and today we're taking a detailed look at the Prairie Tactical Bolt. Um, this is one of my demo cans, several thousand rounds through it, and so the first thing we're going to do is give it a bath and start working some of this garbage off of here. So, into my tank of CLR she goes, and I'll see you when we dig her out. All right, uh, we've got our bolt out of the dip tank. So now it's just time to get her disassembled so we can wipe everything off. So you know she breaks down into sections. We have our muzzle end and then our different sections. Our end cap and uh, the baffle, I've already taken that apart. This guy's loose. Thing to remember is all of these baffles our left hand thread. So if you don't do it in reverse, again, the tool we send, everything's designed for a reason. This guy works in, sits into the ends of the flange, and then Righty Lucy this time. All right, now we've got this mess all apart. I'm gonna get everything wiped down uh, and then do my hot water bath, get everything nice and clean. And I will see you guys when that's done. All right, we're back. We've got everything cleaned up, hot soap and water. Um, again, the reason for the hot soapy water is it helps remove every last little bit of grit, grime, uh, and anything else. All your baffling is the same, your washers are the same, these four sections are the same. Uh, it gets to be pretty easy. So what we're going to do is we're going to start with our end baffle. So we take our end cap. Again, these are all reverse threads, and we take one, one of our baffles, doesn't matter which one, and we screw it into our end, our end cap. There's one baffle section. So now we have our end baffle done. So we're gonna take one of our mid sections, doesn't matter which one, and there's two ends. The end with the external threading is where the baffling is going to go. So the first thing we're going to do is take one of our washers and it sets in. And then we're going to take one of our baffles, again, left hand thread, and we're going to screw it in. The baffle is what seats the washer. Take our wrench, make it a little snug. That section's done. Now we're going to go ahead and repeat. All right, now we've got considerably less parts that we're having to deal with. Take one of our sections in our end baffle. Now the end baffle is right hand thread. I got all excited. I'm gonna take our tool, snug those guys up. Now, what we have here is an end baffle with an end cap. So there's two baffles in here and our muzzle end of the silencer. From here, we can configure the bolt as normal. So if we want to only run three sections, four, the full length, whatever we want to do, we can do it. And these guys all screw together any which way we want them to. Now we have our full length bolt. Ready for another day of shooting. So if you have any more questions about the bolt, if you have any inquiries or what have you, go to www.ptacsd.com. Uh, go to the contact section and uh, drop us a line. 
Thanks for watching.